on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. <laughs> Wrong. Uh, I uh wait where am I? You're in the head what what's wrong? Uh nothing. Uh, nothing. I just had a bad dream. I, that's all I As soon as Misuki goes in to give Masara a kiss, he's just back away. I know where that mouse been. Wait, what? Nothing. Damn it. Nothing. I. I. Uh, I gotta go. Huh. Wow. This is really game to him. Well, having Koski play with finger paints, encouraging him to be as messy as whatever he wants, especially since they're green. <laughs> Not to mention the whole fact that he did see us together. <sighs> Seriously, I just can't believe how how you talked me into doing all this. It's because you love me. And I love you too. And I love Kotsky. Seriously though. <sighs> Man, he's a heavy sleeper. Well, it's your fault. What? For, uh, pretty much staying awake until he finally snapped out his little trance. Well, we did have to drug him twice. And, <laughs> you, uh, sure as hell snore. What? Yeah, you, you're, you still snore. No, I don't. Hmm. He's a good game, you see, a kiss. And leaving. <sighs> okay. Let's see how you uh, fare now, Masaro. Him following, him seeing, he's like Masaro just being. Overly paranoid, looking over his shoulder, making sure that Izuku is still where he's supposed to be. But this is something that's interesting. This is something really interesting. He goes into this weird, big, big ass building and. Is, Wait, I know this company. Wait, the Odd Roses. Yeah, wait, why would he be here? Izuku just following, slowly just tailing, trying to be as stealthily as possible. <laughs> it's Mr. Yagi Rose. You sly fox. Him being amazingly good at eavesdropping learns that yes, Yairozu and pretty much everyone who used to be part of Izuku's group is in cahoots. First, he thought, was, wait, I thought it was. Oh, I should have known. 
Jolly Rose is just the money. Yeah, he sure does have a lot of money to, to burn. Burn. That's a good idea. But killing him wouldn't, wouldn't restop anything. I, I need something. I need something better. Something. I want him broken. <laughs> I really want him to. Hmm. Let me do some research. Izuku going onto the handy dandy internet and learn more about Yairozu and his family. His daughter, his wife, hell, everyone. But as far as I go when it comes to illegal dealings, yeah, he's not a complete idiot when it comes to hiding it. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna need some help here. Shit. Hmm, actually. Let me call up an old friend. Jin. I'm gonna need your help. <laughs> You're alive! Yes, twice I'm alive. I'm so happy! At least told me you were dead. You should believe me, I was. But I came back with a vengeance. Hallelujah! What? Nothing. Uh, but... If anything... Whatever you need. <laughs> you see, how many copies can you make now? Mm, I'll get the credit measurements. 50 to 75. But they will be a little wonky at 75, you know. So, eh, don't worry, I won't even need 50. I, I just uh, need enough. I'm gonna need a lot of makeup. What? Wait, are are you into cross dressing now? No. I want to scare the absolute hell out of the people who set me up. Oh. Well, wait. Wait, are you saying you you're gonna not gonna what? Are you saying you're going to actually sleep with your former subordinates just to reveal that's you and scare the shit out of them? What? Is that what you want my quirk in the makeup for? Uh, no! No! But are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Hell no, I ain't doing that. I mean, no judging, it's just, it would just be a weird plan. I'm telling you, I, I, I'm not doing that, no. I just need to make them look like they are dead. Oh, oh, okay, I get it. And the fact that there's more than one is proof that, well, at least, is going to be seemingly impossible, especially you disperse them and they say that they're seeing multiple at once. But wait, wouldn't that be kind of difficult considering that they know me? <sighs> Twice, I told you, did they don't know what your quirk is because I kept my mouth shut about it, and I hope you did too. Oh yeah, good point, good point. Yeah. Well, very least, Togo will be happy to hear that you're back. Wait, what? Izuku. As he's hearing the scraping of a knife. Just inch ever so closer to him, him, damn it. 
That's right, I forgot to tell Toga. So, how long have you been alive? Uh, um, not long. No, not long, not long at all. Really? Really? So, you decide that I would be one of the last people to know that you weren't dead? I don't know how to feel about that. Uh, I, uh... Well, I, well, uh, you see, Toka, I, I've been, you know, trying to exact vengeance on one of those who wronged me, you know. And so, sometimes I forget. Did you, you forgot about me, did you? No. No, 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 no. That's actually why I went to see twice. Because I, I knew how close you guys were. And it's obvious I was going to come see. I was wanted to see both of you at the same time. You know, I, I would have figured, hell, if if he was, he he wouldn't lose touch with you. You know, you're a terrible liar. You're stuttering. You're sweating, and you smell like a woman. What? You smell like Mitsuki. It is Mitsuki, isn't it? So you're banging Masaru's wife. You better have a good ass reason why I should castrate your ass. Because Koski's my boy. And Masaru and the others set me up. What? I just... No, 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 no. Say that again? I said Masaru and the others. No, 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 not that. Mitsuki? Mitsuki? The same blonde Mitsuki who has a son named Kaski? It's is yours? Not Masaru. I'm gonna get that bitch. <laughs> Please, don't. let's not do anything hasty here. No, 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 no. It's. I've already thought a lot about this, but you just heard about it now. Listen, don't don't worry about it. I, I'll take care of everything. All you need to do is wait here and stay pretty for me. Uh, what are you going to do? <laughs> Trust me, it, it's better if you don't know so you can have deniability. Okay, how about this? When I kill off everyone who stabbed me in the back and did me wrong, you can be a part of it. What? Yes, we are going to be killing the bastards that killed me. Sound fun? What's the plan? Upon hearing that it will involve other women, Uizuku is going to have to have, well, close time with, Toga is stabbing his chair with him in it between his legs. So, yes, he is trying to calm her down. It's slightly working, but sort of not. We're trying to give me a good reason why I don't cut them off. Um. Uh. Because I. Um. Uh. 
because you, uh, I want you to be one of my baby mamas. <laughs> All you hear is a clatter of a knife. He's like, "Are you serious?" <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's worse. You're crazy. I love the way you think. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <sighs> so you're you're not just trying to protect your family jewels. No, I, I promise. I promise. <sighs> and to God, yes, I promise. <sighs> I want to knock you up. I promise. Hmm. Okay. Fine. I'll, I'll trust you. But as soon as all this is over, yes, I'm expecting you in my room. Uh. uh okay. Will your knives be joining us? That depends on my mood. I also have a question. These other women. Yes. Are they going to join the ranks of your baby mamas? No! I, I mean, I don't, I, it's, it depends if it's part, it might end up being part of the plan. <laughs> That's right, I, I want more details about this plan later. But first. <sighs> I'm tired. And she just jumps onto Izuku's lap and is like, wait, what are you doing? Carry me to my room. But, isn't your house, like, Three blocks away, yes. Now, get to walking. Unless... I'm feeling a knife itching a little too close for comfort. He starts running. Twice the... Oh, young lug, fuck you. Him getting stabbed by Toga in the arm. Like, you're not taking twice... That's not what it meant. As yes, Izuku has been planning his vengeance twice, making multiple on multiple clones of him. It's a crazy ass mess when you really consider the fact that Izuku. Is trying to spook everyone. Inko, seeing how it's getting to Hazashi, what comes to Masaru? He's, he's barely sleeping. He drinks so much coffee, so much Red Bull, Monster, hell, you name it, just to make sure he doesn't fall asleep again. Like, wow. I wanted them broken, but... And they're not broken enough. I might as well ruin more of their lives. Just out of spite. Hmm. And then there is Mr. Yagi Rose. His daughter is around my age. I think she goes to... What? UA? It's gonna take a while. I could try to get in touch with some of my friends on the police force, but no, no, I can't do that. That will reveal me. <sighs> Damn. If I can just get closer to her. But how? That's it. If I stage a kidnapping in which Mr. Gariozu needs more security for his little girl. Yes. Hmm. 
Which, you know, might be too suspicious to have a new person trying to, as then, he sees a car speeding off, as well as a bunch of other people shooting at the car. Him wondering what the hell's happening as he's like, someone kidnapped my daughter. Echoes, and he sees this Mr. Yairozu. Izuku's like, seriously? Just, just looking up, is it? God, are you, God, are you, are you, are you making these situations for me? Just so it's easier? I am nodding my head, yes. And that is the end of this part.